um, machine gun together, and that would have been perfect. This was a 30 minute mission. This is not what I expected, to be quite honest. Okay, please get me out of here. Bam. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. I want to let my dog out real quick while this game continues its stuff. Alright, so we've come to. We got a freaking. Oh my, oh my god, that was my arm, fam. My dog's barking. Hopefully, you guys can't hear that. Oh my god. Is he gonna rip my leg off? Good lord. Oh, he just punched my arm off. Jesus freaking Christ. This is, this is brutal. And he's getting shot. Oh my god. Hey. Hey is the only thing you have to say to me. Hey. He just walks up to the dude with no arms and possibly no legs and just is like, hey. What's up? You don't got no legs anymore. That sucks, fam. I already hate this Taylor guy. I really do. Already. So we killed 184 people. That was terrible. That was terrible. He said hey to me. I can't even. Where am I? It's okay. Calm down. Just relax. You're gonna be fine. You got smarter than you. Achieved our objective. Man's always gonna be better than machine. Unfortunately, you sustain life-threatening injuries. You bet they're freaking. Oh my lord! This game, dude. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up, don't you? I don't know what the freak's going on right now, but uh, <laughs> that was stupid. Like literally, our arms get punched off. What year is it? Oh, it's 2065. That's not that much farther off of uh, freaking Black Ops 2. Like he could still be in the game, I guess. Hey, still with us? Welcome back, Taylor. Yeah. Do you know what's happening to you? Am I dreaming? Well, let's say you are. Why not just go with it? Indeed. Right? After all, you can I don't really know. <laughs> so let's see. Uh, arms and freaking legs of a freaking... Uh, 12, 2054, 730 How about... Cool. Our cargo... Prototype Sitting back down, fam. Neural network initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of writing itself. Hope you guys can't hear my freaking bed. Any other system in the world. State of the art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. Did he just like, does he know what's going on? It seems like he knows what's going on. I wasn't exactly paying attention right there because I was trying not to make too much noise, but. 7.31 a.m. A terrorist group what detonated the freak? an explosive device on board this train. The incident sent back our robotics program several years. Did, did we go back in time? You're here to stop it. This isn't real. It can't be real. What is happening? Right now, right now, you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a direct neural interface. All right, I get it. I get it. Too, so I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. We're connected. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. You got a long way to go. I 
I don't know about you, but that was pretty freaking weird. But uh, all right, I, I get what he's saying. So we're pretty much fully robotic right now. Do we now? We just went back in time, 2054. Or four. This is already confusing me, fam. 30 a.m. December 11th, 2054. Zerk security forces receive an anonymous tip, giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using. Unfortunately, the ZSF underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing. They got caught with their pants down, and they took it hard. Outcome? Train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. I'm gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Communication, brother. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor. You're a fucking dick. He didn't hear shit. If I want to talk to you, the DNI transmits on a closed channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know, if you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, <laughs> brother, he's gonna mess you up worse than those right This is pretty legit, I gotta say, actually. Let's go see if you can do this without ending up with Swiss cheese. So I'm like guessing we're still in the simulation of previous events or whatnot, okay. so I guess that all makes sense, but uh, alright. Yeah, this is a simulation, I'm pretty sure. So wait a minute, Th this technically means we can pick up any gun we want now, right, since we don't have human arms anymore. I, I really don't know if that has anything to do with it. And you think if you're more robotic, wouldn't you have more health? Maybe? I don't know, I'm just saying, man. Get over here. Your DNI can provide contact. Hargo DNI tactical mode? What the freak is that? Switch it to tactical mode. Like opening your eyes for the first time, right? Oh. Oh, I like. Okay. Like marking stuff for me? That's pretty legit. Dude, these people and their grenades. I swear to freaking god. They need to stop throwing grenades! Excuse me! So they think people throw a lot of freaking grenades, just saying. I do like how it shows you where you can where people are too, so it makes it easier for you to end up uh hitting them. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Alright! Use your enhanced mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try so are we gonna be able to thrust now? Says you can do it. Oh, that's legit. Not sure if I have to hold it or not. I'll test that out later. I have to say that again. No, we don't have to hold the button. That's cool. Yeah, we don't have to do that actually. Makes it kind of easier. <clears throat> Alright. Activate that again. Is it? Yeah, there we go. I do like how it pinpoints people voice too. It's pretty nice. I'm guessing I don't have a uh, thrust jump yet. That's okay. Maybe we'll get it later. See the red and yellow markers? Kill zones. Not somewhere you want to be. So I don't want to be in this yellow zone right now because it's kill zone apparently. Hmm, get on here. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Man, you can shoot grenades. That'd be freaking legit. So yeah, it even shows you like the explosion radius of a grenade, maybe, or like maybe like that's the explosion radius of like where it'd be fatal. Pretty cool. I just like how it pinpoints enemies for you, you know, so now you know where they are. These guys throw so many freaking grenades, though. I've never in my freaking life seen that many grenades thrown. That's a lot of grenades. Done this area, right? Yep. Attack mode info is synced across the team. Attack mode is synced across the team. One of us sees something, we all see it. Pretty cool, alright. It's pretty lit right now. This first mission was terrible, but this is pretty fun. That first mission can go die in a hole for all I care. It's definitely a lot. Yeah.